A malware is on the rise that can hack your accounts even if you use two-factor authentication. This malware can easily gain access to your Gmail and bank accounts. By the time you realize it, all your money is gone and you lose access to your Gmail permanently. In this video, you will learn how this malware works, how it gets on your computer, and how to protect yourself. How does this malware work? The malware I'm talking about is a cookie stealer. It steals cookies and sessions from your computer to gain access to your accounts. When you sign in to your Gmail or bank accounts, a cookie is created to identify your computer. This cookie stores information like the authentication code and session token. That's how a secure service identifies you. When you log in with two-factor authentication and tick the box for remember me or trust this computer, the authentication is stored on your computer in the form of a cookie. A hacker infects your computer with malware and then steals the cookies. They use the cookie to hijack your session with the secure server. Your bank or Gmail server looks for the cookie and bypasses all other verification steps, trusting the machine since a valid cookie is present. The hacker gains access to your account, stealing your money or sensitive information. How does it get on your computer? Cybercriminals use phishing emails to infect your PC with session-stealing malware. They have become very creative when crafting phishing emails. Some even use AI to make these emails look more legitimate and lure users into their traps. The emails include links or documents. When you click on the link or download the attachment, you get infected. Your antivirus might not catch it because the malware signature hasn't been updated in its database yet. This allows the malware to run in the background, continuously stealing your sessions. Hackers use social engineering methods to trick you into downloading the malware. They design emails to create curiosity or fear among users, prompting them to download the attachment or click on the link. You need to stay aware of such emails. Once this malware infects your PC, removing it can be very challenging. If hackers gain access to your Gmail account, you're unlikely to recover it. If your bank account is compromised, your money may be gone forever, and it could take months to restore your account. How to protect yourself. Harden the security. If you are using any third-party antivirus software on your PC, ensure it is properly configured by enabling all protection types. If you're using Windows Defender, that's completely fine, but you need to harden its security. To do this, use a tool. Open your search engine and search for Configure Defender GitHub. Click the Andy full link. Here, click the code button and select download zip. Once the file is downloaded, extract it and open the configuredefender.exe. Click yes in the UAC pop-up. You'll see an interface with options like default security, high, interactive, and max. I recommend using max hardening as it will block every kind of threat. Enable file extensions. This step is crucial as hackers often disguise executable files as documents in phishing emails. The file icon might look like a PDF or Word document, but it's actually an executable file. Enable file extensions to verify files before opening them. In File Explorer, click on the View button, go to Show, then enable file name extensions and hidden items. Malicious Page Blocker Another helpful measure is using a malicious page blocker to protect you if you accidentally click on a suspicious link. I use the Bitdefender Traffic Light extension, which stops me from accessing malicious websites. Update your antivirus. Regularly update your antivirus signature database. While session-stealing malware might use a new signature that isn't in the database yet, some cases are preventable if your antivirus company has identified the malware. Keeping your antivirus updated ensures it can stop the threat when possible. If you follow these precautions, you can protect yourself from session-stealing malware.